What's up everybody, this is Steve Sterlacci, and what you just heard was me jamming over a backing track that I generated using artificial intelligence, which has been such a big topic of discussion lately in the world where everything's becoming easier and we're able to use technology to do a lot of stuff that we wouldn't be able to do previously. So not only am I using the AI there, but I'm also using my Tonex. So the tone that you heard was using the Tonex pedal and the Line 6 H st HX stomp. The Tonex also uses AI to uh, copy guitar sounds. That's essentially what I've done with my guitar rig behind me here. So I've captured those using AI, put them in a box, and now I am making a backing track using AI and I'm combining those together. That's what you heard in the intro. So today we're talking about LaLal AI, which is an artificial intelligence technology that will remove stems. It will basically deconstruct a mix for you where you can separate tracks, you could separate guitar, you could separate vocals, and you can deconstruct any song that you want. So particularly as a guitar player for me, what I wanna use this for is to learn songs and to learn solos from my favorite guitar players. There's so many things nowadays where it's the get rich quick fixes where it's like, we have the best soloing system where you can learn. If you just give us your money, you can learn how to play guitar much better and you'll be so great. There's really no substitute for learning how to play music as a guitar player other than really playing the songs, really trying to copy how your favorites do it, getting nuance, getting some real good um, understanding of why things are happening and how they're happening musically versus just here's a bunch of shapes, here's a, here's a shortcut, here's a hack. There's no hack. So what I'm using this for is to deconstruct my favorite guitar solos. So I can't do that today with my favorite solos because I don't want to get demonetized. So I'm using a track I got from Epidemic Sound, which I subscribe to, so I'm allowed to use their music in my videos. And I'm able to pull off the guitar solo. So I have two separate tracks. One track is a guitar solo, just isolated guitar. It's a guitar solo, a guitar isolated, a soloed guitar, you know what I mean. And then I have the track without the guitar, which is my backing track. So the backing track you heard me play over was that backing track with the lead guitar removed. And I'm gonna show you how to do that right now using lalal.ai. They also sponsored this video, so I wanna thank them very much. And they also are offering a referral program right now where you can actually get free minutes. That's how it works, you basically buy minutes. So you can actually get them for free if you sign up for the referral program, get a couple of people to sign up and you get those minutes kicked back to you. So you can get back more minutes to uh, separate files or clean up your audio. And here's how it works. So you go, you just go to their homepage. And so all you gotta do is click and drag right into the queue here and it'll upload it and it'll process it for you. And it'll generate a preview so that you can actually hear what it sounds like and test it out before downloading it. So if by any chance something really went wrong and it wasn't a clean um, extraction, you can just redo it here or maybe upload a different file. So here you have all the options that you could select. Obviously I have electric guitar selected, but you can pick any of these to separate and it will separate it. So now I have my electric guitar separated here and let's hear what this sounds like. So this is what you would use if you wanted to learn a specific guitar part or maybe get a guitar tone down, you can pull the lead guitar sound off of a track and be able to learn it. Let's get to the guitar solo. So there you hear there's a guitar solo at the end. The preview unfortunately stops, but, and then here, without the electric guitar, now you have your backing track so you can play along. And that's pretty good. I mean, there's very few little artifacts in there. I guess, I think it's EQ based, so it'll find a specific frequency and it'll duck that out. So there is a little bit of a conflict sometimes between, I guess, hi-hats and guitars or 
you know, just whatever it is gets caught in the different frequencies. So you will hear some artifacting, but I think it actually kind of sounds cool and kind of sounds like weird little percussion instruments that might have been thrown into a track when you're soloing over it. So now I have two separate files where I can process the entire file and then I get my electric guitar separated and I get my backing track. And again, that's what you heard in the intro of the video. And just for reference, here is what the actual song sounds like. So now I can pull those specific parts, loop those sections and learn it and then put my own spin on it, play to the backing track like I did in the intro. So that does it for this video on how I'm using AI to get better at guitar. Let me know if you guys have any questions, problems, concerns, or other in the comments. This is my first AI product that I've really been using as far as um, stem extraction. So let me know what your experiences are with this type of thing. I'd love to hear from you in the comments. And if you made it this far in the video, thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next one.